and welcome to the Bring It On New Festival Newsroom. My name is Anna Boscampino. We'll be bringing you reports from all stores throughout the day. Hi, my name is Kiara Smith. We have reporters and film crews on the ground bringing you the latest up-to-date information and entertainment news from the show. Newsroom is a volunteer initiative from Fairfield City Council with people from 14 to 20 years of age. We have put together a fully working newsroom with on-camera presenters, two reporting crews and a fully servicing crew. Sound, editing, camera crew and directors have all been brought together and trained via a training program run by Fairfield City Council. So let's take a look at the show. It's good to, you know, help out the community. Yeah, definitely the people you work with is so great. Yeah, made many friendships. amazing you get to interact with all the youth so at least when they come to our centers they're well educated as to what they need and how they can go ahead and apply for their licenses it's great I mean they're great guys they're very they're very friendly and very well mannered it's different different environment to what we see at work so yeah no it's great um, I guess it's a uh, it's really good to see the community coming together and um, all different people from different walks of life kind of uh, meeting and yeah, just being able to, to share some common ground and just learn a bit um, from each other as well. Let's take a look at our first report. Here is a report compiled by the newsroom team that explains the video and broadcast course. It's a youth week event put on for young people um, for, by Fairfield City Council. The Parks Community Network is a partner in that event and they usually run workshops and participate in the event. I'm working behind the scenes for the Bring It On Festival in um, the film and broadcasting crew. I learned how to approach people, how to keep them talking and just like, yeah. My name is Cecilia Bolibun and I go to Bonnerick High School. You'll make heaps of friends and they'll be very inviting. You'll have a great teacher for sure um, and you'll learn so many new things. It's good when you're learning I guess because you know you meet other people you make really good friendships and like I've made a good connection with you and also with the friends and it just made me come out of my comfort zone more confident now and yeah. Today I'm looking after the editing along with uh, one of the other girls here and we're just compiling some of the, the clips that the team uh, the camera team will be going around and collecting and recording and we're going to put it all together and put it on show for. My name is Julie Chessier. Um, I go to Freeman Catholic College and I'm here for work placement for entertainment at school. I'm actually a little surprised because I actually thought that I would go a little bad, but like I'm actually going good. I'm Jamie Fan. I go to Freeman Catholic College. It's an interesting experience and if you would like the in entertainment industry, you should go for it. And it's free, so just volunteer. My name's Kiara Smith and I'm from Freeman Catholic College. I've done a few things but, like in front of a camera before, so I thought I would be okay, but uh, I think I'm a lot more confident than I thought I would be, so that's good, yeah. Definitely try it out, it's an amazing course. Uh, there's a lot to learn and best of all, it's free. So definitely come along and uh, just try and put some time into doing it. That report was brought to you by the newsroom team. Our crews and editors have been working hard to bring you reports from the show. Here is our first live report. I guess it just gives us um, a chance to interact with the community, um, for, for them to come up and ask us questions in a um, in a fun environment, so they don't feel pressured. They can come up, have a chat pick up a few things and just ask questions. Yes, there's a lot of free stuff. A lot of free stuff. I have this one here, free tattoo. <laughs> it's fun, there's kids, they muck around, you get to show them the photo, but they get excited. Yeah, no. Nice. Great interactive day for the kids, yes. for the family. It's a great family day. So far, the 2018 Bring It On Festival has been, the, has been the most successful in the history of Bring It On. Fairfield City Council has managed to put together an amazing array of food stores, music acts, entertainment and education, bringing it all to you at the Fairfield Showgrounds. 
Uh, I'm one of the directors here and I have to basically tell people what to do. People were, were recording interviews around the festival and then my job was to edit all in like under 30 minutes and it was really hard but it was worth it. Um, definitely give it a try, maybe even try volunteering because um, it's nice to see the behind the scenes. Interesting and like um, they're so nice and I like it and we work like a team. I say give it your all and um, even if you're shy or not, you're going to have a great time. I 100% recommend it because it gives us an experience and just watching other people do many things and seeing how everything just correlates together and just it's just a wonderful feeling um, to see. Well that's it for the Bring It On Festival for this hour. We will be bringing you news updates and reports throughout the day. My name's Kiara Smith. And my name's Annabelle. Thank you for watching.